I'm to a hospital. We had better be quick. He is sinking fast. Help me get him to the car. someone in the city building department. Oh, I'll say it does. The commissioner of public works has disappeared and the state has taken over the job. And the Sentinel certainly busted that racket wide open. You might give the Green Hornet some of the credit. You certainly admire that night riding mask bandit, Miss Case. Morning, Chief. Morning, Jenks. You're late, Mr. Reed. And I do admire the Green Hornet. I like any man who knows what he wants to do and does it. Maybe he's clearing away competition so he can start his own rackets. I don't believe it. The Green Hornet is just what this city needs. Anyway, he's just what the Sentinel needs. Have you seen the circulation figures? Well, that helps. What about those men that escaped from the tunnel? Have you located any of them? Nah, that bunch won't talk. After what happened to Gorman and Grant. I found out one thing, though. Every one of them was covered by a big insurance policy written by a broker named Mortensen and payable to the company that employed them. Do you mean that someone expected to make a profit if those men were killed? So that suggests a good editorial. Shoot. Gunning can put this in a box on the front page. And had it? Profit in death. They haven't accused Mortensen of anything. That doesn't mean they don't suspect him. We've got to stop these sentinel attacks. What have you done about Britt Reed? We've got two of our best men watching every move he makes. Watching him? With instructions to eliminate him when it can be done safely. Mortensen ought to be here now. I told him to come in at this time. Mortensen, you're late. Late, of course I'm late, with reporters lying in wait for me every way I turn. Who spilled the story about the insurance on those men? Markheim, maybe. Or the Green Hornet. You suppose Markheim told him the names of the rest of us? No, if he had, we'd have heard about it before this. Chief's waiting to give you your orders. Mortensen's here, sir. All right, Mortensen. Take all papers pertaining to the tunnel job and hide out at your country place until you hear from me. Wait. Get him back. I want to know what protection I'm to have against the Green Hornet. There are 12 of us in this thing together. Only 11 now. Markheim's gone. You better obey orders, Mortensen. Chief's taking steps to identify the Green Hornet. Did you interview Mortensen? Oh, can't find him. His office says he's left town for a few days. Yeah, a lot of people have left town since that story broke in the tunnel, John. Oh, Mr. Reed. Sure, I found him. Found who? Martinson, the murdering cool. Wait a minute. We know his accomplishments. What do you have to say? I ain't seen him yet. <laughs> but he's at his country house on the Westwood Pike, seven miles out. The place is closed up, but I found his car in the garage. 
So that's what makes you think he's there? Yes, sir. And when a couple of thugs made up like gardeners run me off the place, I knew he was there. So now I aim to get my friend, Captain Ridge, of police headquarters. Wait a minute, Michael. We have no definite proof that Mortensen has done anything criminal. If we start making charges, we'll have a libel suit on our hands. Oh, sure, but I know that Mortensen... Forget is... Mortensen and try to find some of those men that escaped from the tunnel. I'm calling it a day. See you tomorrow. How can I call it a day and go looking for people up at... Uh, I tell you, it just don't make sense. It... That's all for tonight. Reed's gone to bed. We'll report to Monroe. Those men that were watching the house have gone, Cato. And the Hornet will talk to this Mortensen tonight, Mr. Britt? Yes, I believe he and his associates are taking out insurance on men in dangerous jobs so they can profit by their death. All right, kiddo. on this fellow Martinson, and I want you to get out of him and question him. Still playing detective, are you, Mike? There's no evidence against Martinson to justify an arrest. Well, I'd get it. With the force behind me, I can shoot some tough questions at this guy. All right, Mike, take Tim with you and see if the man will talk. I'll send a couple of more men after you. Okay, Captain. Let's go. I pick up Tim round and back. Far enough, Cato. Throw off your lights and silence the motor. Stand by and be ready for a quick getaway. Martinson. The Green Hornet. Right. What do you want? I know you're one of the 11 racketeers in this criminal ring. I don't know what you're talking about. Come clean, Martinson. There's enough evidence in those envelopes to send you up for life. Who's the big shot back of this racket? Wait, wait. I'll talk. Ask the police to pay me a visit tonight. Ah, you don't want to see the police any more than I do. I'm the caretaker here. There's nobody home. Don't give me that line. We know Martinson's here. Go in, Tim. I'll keep this guy here. Did you 
see him, the green hornet? He held me up. Sit down. Who's that the cops bringing out? Not yet, wait. I tell you, he was trying to force me to open my safe, and your siren sounded, and he ran out. Yeah? Well, that's a good story, but you're coming down and tell it to the chief. Come on. Come on, Mortensen. There's a car in the back lane. And I've got to find out who fired that shot. Why, you dumb mug, you'll get us all hung. Clear out. I'll handle this. Quick, officer, this man has been shot by the Green Hornet. Stand over there and don't move. Morton's must be making a getaway. man how the hornet was trying to rob me when he came back in the door and fired. Sounds fishy to me. That's right, Lieutenant. Mortensen didn't shoot me. It was... The Green Hornet. Now you know I'm speaking the truth. Back up, back up, back up. Green Hornet shoots down officer. Hornet's to be The police dragnet is out for the Hornet. But so far, nothing is known of the identity or whereabouts of the mysterious night riding bandit. That's a good story, Jenks. Oh, thanks, Chief. Not so good. I don't think the Hornet did the shooting, if he was there at all. Oh, he was there all right. Plenty of witnesses heard that Hornet siren of his when he left. Listen, Chief, I think the Sentinel ought to offer reward for the Green Hornet. A reward for the capture of the Hornet? Yeah. Well, you think they'll get him? I don't know about that, but it would certainly boost circulation. You never lose sight of that end of it, do you? Oh, Brick. Oh, oh. Look, I took the police out there last night. And I suppose it was the Green Hornet that hit you. It was indeed, and when I wasn't looking. And anyway, I still think Martinson knows all about that racket. Yeah, and thanks to your bringing the police out there, he's been whitewashed. He can refuse to talk to reporters, and the police will vouch for him. Work out that reward idea and let me see it. Those are orders, Mortensen, direct from the chief. Andy will be at your place tonight. Remove all evidence and head for the border. Why should I run away? I've got the cops with me now. And the Green Hornet against you, since you laid that shooting to him. Yes, I guess you were right. Both Andy and I had better clear out. And remember, don't leave anything that points to the rest of us. <laughs> Her to sleep. He shrieks like a baby, but louder. <laughs> Good. Could you burgle a safe? Not burgle, Mr. Britt. But if it is necessary to open the safe, to uphold the law. That's the idea. It save many lives. Are you ready? Yes, sir. All right, let's go. stuff. That's the car that escaped us last night. He won't escape us tonight. Shall I catch him? Later. He's headed for the state line and he'll stick to this highway. We'll take a look at his safe. It's 
not rock. Wait. Looks like a trap. Too convenient. Lights on, safe open. Hand me one of those curtain cords. My wife, sir. I guess Mortensen must have taken the papers we want. Let's go. Gas is pretty low. We'd better stop at the next service station. The Hornet, step on it. We'll be out of gas in a minute. Just an awful. Not yet. If these were found, we'd all hang. She's going up to take on water. Go up near the tank. Board that train. Keep going. Follow the train. When we want speed. Look out, Mortensen! The green one. It's no use, Mortensen. You haven't a chance in a million. 